Knuddel Model. Knuddel Model. Knuddel Model. Model. Knuddel Model. Knuddel Model. Knuddel Model. Knuddel Model. Model. Knuddel Model. Hey guys, it's me, Tristan, back at German 5050s again, joined by Ray and Min. How are you guys feeling? Pretty good, pretty good, pretty confident. He lived in Berlin, so he knows uh, all these words. Yeah, sure. <laughs> sure, yeah guys, let's go. In case you missed it last time, guys, I'm gonna say one real German word, and then I'm gonna say fake sentence and real sentence, and they, would, they need to guess which one is right and which one is just complete random. First word. Okay. Purzelbaum. A person who designs toilets or a somersault on the ground. Purzelbaum. All right, I think it's the second one, I think. Faker roll. Okay. <laughs> Since that's the definition now. I, I think first one. I can just... Someone who designs toilets? Yeah. Uh -huh. It is a somersault, actually. <laughs> Honestly, I had to just guess that one, but that, it sounded more like that, so... Knuddel model. Knuddel model. Knuddel model. Model. Knuddel model. Knuddel model. Knuddel model. Knuddel model. Model. Knuddel model. Perfect. It's a person who makes dolls and stuffed animals and sells them on the street. Or a really messy room or really chaotic room. Second one. Second one. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna go with the first one, even though none of those make sense to me. I don't know. With the <laughs> word itself, I don't get it. <laughs> I've never heard that word. So you're not feeling the word knuddle model? There's I mean, nothing, I there's know nothing going like, on, like no I, connections? I, I, I mean, like, knuddle is just like the food, but like, I don't really know, like, the combination of the two and why that would mean <laughs> either of those words. So I'm just gonna go with the first one because it's not, it just sounds like something a German would say. I don't know. For, Mid is actually right. Okay. It's actually just like, yeah. whatever. it's like, you just I feel like the it. word itself sounds really chaotic and like really like just confusing. Yeah, so it's I just guess. like a <laughs> sweet The next word actually, it's pretty funny. Never heard that one before. Sitzfleisch. A supermarket that doesn't sell meat or someone who has a tolerance for things that are boring. Well, I mean, the first one makes the most sense to me, but I, I feel like because that makes the most sense, maybe it's the other one for some reason, because you didn't know it either. <laughs> <laughs> but the response you're giving mm. me right now means it's probably the first one, right? <laughs> so I'm gonna go with the first one. What the hell is he doing, guys? He's trying to get into my head. I don't know, maybe Min, you, you, I don't know what you, I don't know if you're gonna go with the first or second, just a coin flip. It's so coin flip here. For everyone who didn't know, Ray knows some German and he knows meat means flesh, but it's actually wrong. Okay, why did you give me that response then? <laughs> You're like, oh, why would you? Because I'm the host and I need to make it exciting for everyone. You actually played me. Because I'm the host and I need to make it exciting for everyone. You actually played me so hard. I thought for sure it was going to be the one I didn't think it was going to be, but. Go okay, Min won. Min knew it actually. <laughs> so smart. Zungenbrecher, a German tongue twister, or the end of the line of a train. Do you know what a tongue twister is? No. Uh, so for English, there's a poem that you say that's like hard. It's like hard to say because you muddle the words up. Sally sells seashells by ah, the gan, seashore. Gan zang, gan zang, gan zang, gan zang, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Ah, twister. okay, okay, okay. Yeah, that's a tongue twister. Uh, I think I will go for first one. So German tongue twister. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. that's what it sounds like. Right? Both wrong. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, both right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah Erklärungsnote. Okay. Explaining to your parents how much you love them, or it's when you're put on the spot without a good explanation or excuse for something you haven't done or failed to do. Alright, Min, you go first, because if I go first, then he can just copy me and not. It's, okay, an, okay. Auto. it's an auto win. I think. Him. It's second one. I can't feel it. God damn. <laughs> damn. Alright, okay. I'm, it's the second one, right? I mean, yes. I guess I, I should just guess the first one in case. <laughs> Even though I know it's like, I have to guess the first one in order to win, right? 
Which one do you think is right? I think the second one's right, but I'll guess the first one. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> because I have to in order to win, right? Min one. It's the second one. Okay, whatever. What? Ah, I, easy. If I guess easy. the second one, then I lose anyways because he's already winning my one. Nice so, try, nice try. That, yeah, was nice that was a nice try. That was a nice try. I'd rather just win, you know? Guys, the winner is who had fun in this show, okay? <laughs> That's clearly you <laughs> then because you're the one laughing at us half the time. Purze Baum. Sitzfleisch. Knuddelmudde. Zungenbrecher. Erklärungsnot. I think Knödelmödel. I, I like that one. Yeah. I don't know how to say that. Is that. It's like for a messy room, right? Or something? Yeah, it's just like being like being a mess, kind of like a messy room, being like chaotic. It's like gonna, chaotic stuff. I'm you definitely going to use that one because uh, I've seen Tristan's desk a few times, so I'll have to give him the Knödelmödel. <laughs> the faker rule. The, the, the faker rule was Putzebaum. 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 Hope you guys enjoyed this time, German 50-50s. Yeah, it was pretty fun. Yeah, pretty fun, pretty fun. I right. can't believe I lost, but knowing some German to someone who knows no German, but I guess that's just some German words, you know? Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and maybe even leave in the comments which German word is next. So next time it's gonna be even more fun. <laughs>